I'm Mikey and you're watching City Lights on Novus TV. Today we're at the Windsor Indoor Turf Bubble here in North Vancouver for a charity soccer tournament. The fundraiser will be benefiting the Razzie Network for Disabled Children. Let's find out more. I am here with Farshad, yes. one of today's organizers. Now, can you tell us what's happening here today? Uh, so yeah, we're gathering here, about 250 people are here, and we are organizing the sixth Razzie Network and Shane FC Indoor Soccer Tournament. Uh, this is the sixth year we're doing this, and it has improved every year in the number of participants, sponsors, fans, and yeah, in the number of people attending the tournament. Uh, so yeah, we're very happy with the outcome, and we are planning for bigger things next year. So how did it actually get started? I believe it uh, benefits a particular charity? Uh, yes, we work with a charity organization called uh, Razzie Network, and uh, we donate the money, partial proceeds of the money raised from this tournament to Razzie Network to help uh, children with mental disabilities. Uh, so we're very proud of achieving that. Uh, so if people want to get involved or perhaps join your soccer club, where can they go? Uh, well, our website is www.shaneefc.com. We've got more info about our club on, on that website. And you could go on the website and uh, find out more info about the team's history, how it all, it all started, and what we've been doing throughout the past few years. Uh, and the Razzie Network's website is also www.razzienetwork.org. And our Facebook page, page is facebook.com slash razzienetwork.org. You can find out more info about the tournament itself and also about Shane FC on, our, on both our websites and our Facebook page. Uh, yeah. Tell us about your involvement in the tournament today. Uh, we were just asked to put in a team because it's for charity and it's for a good cause. So the uh, team we play with um, just for fun, uh, we decided to put a team in. And obviously you're with the co-ed team. How is it playing with a, a group of guys? Uh, it's a lot of fun. Some of the guys go a bit harder than others and it kind of hurts sometimes, but other, it's pretty good. It's good to get challenged. Can you tell us what it means to you about being part of, say, a charity event? Um, it's great to see so many people get together for a good cause. That's first and foremost. And um, anything to support it, we're in, especially if it means playing soccer and having fun at the same time. So it's good. And it's great to see so many people, so many teams signed up for it. You actually play soccer for school, right? For uh, UBC. Thunderbirds, yeah. Oh, and you mentioned something about playing Canada-wide? Yeah, it's, uh, I mean, you uh, qualify uh, in the Canada West. There's a few universities like Alberta, University of Alberta. Um, uh, there is uh, Fraser Valley, University of Fraser Valley, and um, uh, Prince George, and uh, some other universities. And we compete, and the winner of that goes to the CIS uh, National uh, final, uh, Tournament, where um, all the universities come together, and um, we basically play in a tournament. And uh, if you win, you get the national title. And we've uh, done that our second year in a row. So uh, we're, we're fortunate to have uh, another title. Coming from that, how does it feel to be part of something a little more uh, community-based? Yeah, commu I mean, it's, uh, it's, it's great to see, I mean, friends, you know, uh, in a tournament and you get to play with your friends. It's a different, uh, uh, I mean, level, but uh, like, it's not that, I mean, that's serious, but uh, like, I mean, if, when we play at UBC, like we train every day and, you know, we have one goal, and that's to win the national title. But here, it's just like a friendly, you know, tournament where uh, winning isn't that important. But you know, we it's it's a good way of uh, like connecting with uh, everyone in the community. And so, since you play and you're a sort of a national champion, it must be a little bit intimidating for the people on the the field to be playing against you. Uh, actually, I mean, the other guys, yeah, they do kind of like say oh you guys have a good team and stuff like that I mean I have another friend uh, that, that's on that, that's on UBC it's his third year as well so I mean our, I, I wouldn't say we're better but like I mean we have a different level because uh, we've played our, our whole life and professionally uh, we've played so um, I mean it's a different level and it's again it's a good way of uh, just experiencing <laughs> Thank you. 
Well, the tournament is going well. There's plenty of people out having fun and competing for a good cause. Shaheen FC is the North Shore based soccer club who's hosting today's event. It's a great reason to spend a day on the turf. I'm Mike Evers and you're watching City Lights on Novus TV.